The Taliban reveals details of a meeting with Qatar's Prime Minister in Kandahar. Qatar is set to build a major courts complex to step up legal services. A number of DFI-funded films have made it to the Khan red carpet. And finally, the 2023 Judo World Championships in Doha wraps up with a bang. Hi, it's Ali. This is The Roundup. Here are today's top stories. Afghanistan's ruling Taliban group has urged Qatar to invest in Afghanistan and take action to enhance ties between the South Asian country and the international community. The request was made during a meeting in Kandahar between a Qatari delegation headed by Prime Minister Sheikh Mohammed and the Taliban. The details were revealed by a Taliban spokesperson to local Tolo News, who said Qatar were asked to take steps to help improve relations between the group and the international community. Now, Qatar is set to construct a new courts complex that will host a range of facilities. The the complex will span some 10,000 square meters and will bring together criminal, civil, investment and traffic courts in one area. A separate court of cassation will also be built and official revealed on Qatar TV. He said the purpose of the project is to bring related courts in one place to save time for visitors and provide easy access to them. Over in Khan, the Doha Film Institute has set a first in the Arab region. 13 films supported by the film organization have been selected at the prestigious Khan Film Festival 2023. Two co-financed projects titled about dry grasses and Club Zero will now be viewed at the festival from May 16 to 27. Additionally, Banel e Adama will be the first ever DFI grantee project that is also up for selection. And finally, the 2023 Judo World Championships have wrapped up in Doha after a week of exciting battles. In mixed teams action, Japan took home the gold with France finishing runners up and Georgia and the Netherlands sharing the bronze. Sonia Akira of Japan won the 78kg gold medal in the women's field, defeating France's Julia Tolo. However, in the men's 100 kg competition, France took home the gold with Teddy Reiner beating Russia's Inal Tasoe. For the entire list of winners, head over to www.dohanews.co. Thank you for joining us. For more of our stories, head over to our website www.dohanews.co. Have a great day.